Hi, it's Lynn Coma with Close to My Heart, and I want to invite you into checking out this great new kit that's for a limited time only called You've Got Class. You might know somebody that's looking to scrapbook their children's school pictures through the years, and this kit will cover a kindergarten through 12th grade and also do a back to school page. So there's a lot in here that's really quick and easy to work with. And I think you'll enjoy seeing the different um, pages that you can create. So whether it's for you, it's for somebody you know, you have grandchildren, you want to make one, this is the perfect kit. And it's just until September 2018, September 30th. Okay, so this kit comes complete with a lot of product in it. But yes, you can buy things a la carte. So let me just go over what comes in the kit, which is 25% off the retail value when you buy it all together. And that's a really great saving. So let's go through what you receive. There are two stamp sets. As you can see right here, this is the one you've got class. So as kindergarten, you can do all of your grades through the 12th grades. You'll use numbers again and again for birthdays and things like that. You can use grade or year, the border stamp. So really a cute stamp set. Here's another one, school kids, adorable, with the three little kids, the ruler, back to school, the schoolhouse, the apple. And if you note, there's thin cuts inside. So these will do your cutting for you. And then what you do is once you thin cut it, you stamp them with black ink, and then you can actually go and color them in with paint, with marker, with watercolors, whatever you'd like. So they're really adorable. And what I like to do is once I stamp extras, I just keep them in my sleeve. That's my little tip of how to keep them. What else comes in the kit? Well, there's plenty more stuff. You receive seven sheets of white daisy cardstock, one each of linen. Uh, we have glacier, lagoon, sapphire, juniper. But you also will receive seven true fit folios. And this is actual a 12 by 12 file folder. And I'll show you how to use this on the kit. You also receive clear bling, three sheets, a package of three by four flip flaps. Now, if you're not familiar with flip flaps, I'm going to show you on another page how easy it is. It just shows you how in a three by four photo, you can add another flip. So instead of having one photo, you can have one, two, three photos all in the same spot. I do recommend a four by six as well, flip flap. They do not come in the kit, but many of my customers have plenty of them. You also will receive pattern paper. Okay, there's 12 sheets. So you have three of each pattern and each sheet has zip strips and you cut them off and you save them. You'll use them on the layouts. But this is one pattern, the yellow, turns over to a red chevron, so four sheets. The note paper, and then it turns over to the balloons. And then you have a green chevron, which turns over to the blue dots. Really cute. So four sheets of each. And what's nice about it is when you do this kit, you'll have enough to make two pages, um, two kits per child, or I'm sorry, two kits for another child just by using the paper that's in here. But you will want to add cardstock and more true fit folios. The other things that I would recommend that you receiving or purchasing if you do not have it uh, is memento ink, black memento, you need lagoon ink. Like I said, for coloring in, you can use watercolor paint with a water brush, which is super easy. Some items I like to pop up, so I use our foam dots or our foam tape. And a Versamat is great for laying out your layout and then knowing exactly where to place it. So you'll see in the directions, it's really helpful. So when you buy the kit, you will want to print out or save all of the directions with the cutting and it tells you how to put each page together. Okay. So let me just show you how cute they come out because they're stinking adorable in the True Fit Folio. So here I have used um, the True Fit Folio to do the kindergarten one. And let's see if we can get that a little bit closer. There you go. So do you see how this is stamped in the black ink, which is the memento? And I used blue paint just to swipe back and forth with the water brush to get that really cute look. See how the girl is colored in? I used paint. You can use, you can use watercolor um, pencils. You can use markers, anything you like. But this is all stamped. And the cutting guide shows you how to cut each piece of paper so that you can use it. Now, if you flip it over, 
It's on the back side of the True Fit Folio. So here you can see the first grade, really cute. Now, let me back out a little bit so you can see. This is a flip, right? So what we're doing here is the extra white cardstock is for you to add another sleeve inside the folio so that you can have all your papers, right? Report cards, achievements, certificates, whatever you like in between. So this would be the first grade. And then if you flip it, this side here would be the kindergarten. And it's so easy to do. Let me just give you a quick story on how to do that. Bone folder, paper trimmer. I'm going to use this paper. I've already done it. But you line this up at my one inch marker ruler on your paper trimmer. You take the point of the bone folder and you slice it, or actually you slide it right in the track and you press pretty hard down. You know, you're really gonna press on that. So now you have a really nice score line. And then you take your bone folder and you ju it just helps flatten it out and give it a nice crisp fold. You would take your True Fit Folio and you would actually put glue here and on the inside so that when you glue it down, I would close it, glue it down, you actually have that pocket. So it's glued along here as well as here for extra strength. Close it up. And that is how you have your extra pocket in here. So that's an option for you. So here, here's your kindergarten. Back that up. And first grade. Second grade is adorable. I love these little kids. You can do the boy or the girl in the kit, whatever you want. This is stamped. Back on the True Fit Folio. Third grade. And then you do all 12 grades. You have an option of, if you want to use white cardstock, you can save the True Fit Folios for another uh, project. I have a, another video showing you how else I've used the True Fit Folios. But some of these, you will want to have the folder to collect all the memorabilia. So here's the fourth grade, fifth grade. Now, do you notice the circles? If you don't have a Cricut, those size circles, you can always do squares. Don't feel that you're limited. But these spots here are where you can add flip flaps, the three by four or the four by six. Sixth grade, all these cute little squares that you're adding work so great. So when you're using the Versamat, and it tells you to start the square at two and a quarter inches in. That's where you're putting that point. That's why I like the Versamat. And it will tell you it's about one and a quarter inches. So you're just following along. This is at four inches, okay? This one is over here is at four inches. So I'm just using the diagram that came with the kit to show me exactly how to do it. There's seventh grade, eighth grade. Here's the school. I popped them up. That's where I use these little pop dots. There's your clear bling that you get also in the kit. This is stamped with the border background. Tenth. Oh, we might have missed ninth, but let's show you. Ninth grade. Now, there's no paper, no matting behind there. You're more than welcome to add a mat. I would add four by six of flip flap so I can do more. And another three by four photo, I forgot to put my photo mat there, but a flip is also going there. So you have a couple of photos that you can put right there. This is 10th. And this is an illusion. This is just a little strip, a half inch strip of paper to make it look long so that you can add four by six and three by fours. These are stamped first, second, and third generation, which is explained in the brochure, showing you exactly how to work that. So simple to do. And there's the 11th grade. So this is stamped. This is stamped. Up here is stamped. I popped up the apple. I like to add a little extra. Um, I did two hearts. I popped one up here. And you'll see here's your paper. This is stamped here. So it's really cute. I also did the other page on the back. Um, this would actually be the first days of school where I would take a picture of my boys when they were getting on the school bus. Uh, it's always one of those happy, sad days at the same time. But you can definitely add one for each grade. You can use the flip flaps or you can add them to the grade that they're, you're doing your photos for. So I hope you enjoyed that. It's really a great program. It's a limited time only. 
And remember that if you make a purchase, you'll definitely want to print out the brochure. And not only that, the pattern paper makes two kits. Uh, I also used some scraps to make cards. I actually had this sitting around, this little apple. So here's a card that I made, right? And using some scraps to fill in, best teacher. Love this one. I'm a big kid now. Great card to send to your child. You can change this to the boy to let them know you're thinking them of them on their first day of school and write your note in there. So cute. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions, let me know. I will be putting the link to the product in the video. Um, not in the video, I'm sorry, in the comments. So you'll have it in the description as well. Have a great day. Thank you.